Somebody called the law. Somebody called the law. It got to be illegal for me to be so wrong. What up, though? Heist man, the foe. Talk that talk, ghetto news and opinions, man. What the hell is going on? I just seen some crazy stuff, man. Um, on Twitter, the internet, and it's Black History Month, man. We got to talk about it, yo. Let's talk about this. Look, I, I, I got to talk about this video, man. I don't know how to discuss this to say this, man. When I first seen that, like, this can't be real. This can't be real. But it was a deep fake. And look at this. You check this out for y'all self, man. This shit, wow. So I made sure you guys got your chicken, your orange soda, or uh, come on now, Kool Aid, if that's what you're into. This can't be real. Oh, I'm really sorry that Jill forgot the watermelon and hot sauce. Listen, I absolutely love the blacks, especially when you people vote for me and not Trump. Shame, shame, shame. Shame the devil. Shame the devil. That is wild, man. They said it was a deep fake, but it was like people were saying, like, even if he did say that, y'all still would go out there and vote for him. I ain't vote for nobody. Didn't vote for the first one, I ain't gonna vote for the next one, or the last one, or the one before that. That ain't my... That ain't my thing. I don't get into religion and politics because that separates people. That shit crazy, man. Now, this shit even crazier right here, man. I thought I put on my lacoon hat. We got to talk about Tommy Sotomayor. I guess that's what you call his name, man. You know, he's getting to it with Corey Holcomb back in the day. That's where I learned from him from. But I seen this. This dude went on CNN, CBS, some shit. I don't know, man. Check this out. This shit, wow. Sotomayor is a radio show host. Tommy, uh, you are my envoy to black America. Johnny's my correspondent. You're my envoy. Will the chicken summit be effective? Come on, man. No, because let me tell you something, Jesse. He forgot to bring watermelon and grape drink. <laughs> now, if he had brought watermelon and grape drink, that would have completed the trifecta. But he <laughs> felt like we only like chicken and we need these things in conjunction with each other. And I'm just sad that he decided to carry it a little farther and say, let me get a hamburger so I can let you know I'm different than you. I don't know if you heard that part. He decided to have a hamburger. He didn't want none of that Negro food. He did not want the chicken, that's for about. sure. We always send Johnny out. I'm sure you've seen all the shows. You never miss an episode of primetime. When I used to go out in the street during the Obama years, I had such a hard time finding a black American who didn't like Obama. Obama could do anything, and they loved him. Johnny goes out now. We have a hard time Nothing. finding black Americans who like Biden. Ain't talking about really. Is that going to translate into anything? That shit, wow. That's nasty work, man. He, like, that's what they brought him up there for, yo. It's Black History Month. They got him up there. This... Talking about some damn chicken and watermelon. That's what they brought you up there to do that, bruh. And you played right into it with it. You just went right in for it. So I got this hat on, man. This was, this was 2024 all about, man. This type of shit right here. Cooning and this shit. Hold on, man. Tell my shit. Now nah, I don't want no balls on my neck. I want no balls nowhere around me. Let's get that clear. That ain't mine. on my balls. That's it. I don't even want to say balls no more. Let's get that out of our damn repertoire this year. Balls is off the... Get the balls off my neck, man. Anyway. Yo, I just, when I seen that, I ain't got no story about this. I don't really care about it. Ain't nothing to really talk about. I, when I seen that, I said, this shit is wild. This shit crazy. And I had this little hat right here. I just wanted to break back out and do it in black and white. And I don't know. Run out of content for the day. I need something to do. And this, was, and this is what it is, yo. Me in a raccoon hat talking about coons and Biden and shit. I don't care about none of these folks, man. It's just, yo. This is a commercial for shit I be doing every Friday right here on this channel, man. I go live every Friday at 9 p.m. Talking about stuff just like this. Y'all just got to come through and holler at me, man. Hit that like button, the comment button, the share button, subscribe button, the notification bell. All them good buttons you got to hit to get this pimping that I'm putting out when I put it out. And like I said, I go live every Friday. I go live every Friday at 9 p.m. Come through, join the conversation. Tell me how do y'all feel about this, especially the deep fake. The deep fake, that shit got me the most because... When I seen it, I'm looking like, damn, did he just say that for real? But it wasn't that. Um, it was deep fake. So they say. I don't know. I don't know. The, I ain't even seen the original footage. I don't care to look for it because I ain't looking for that type shit. I just want to. It 
Y'all can tell the nigga bored today, boy. I'm bored. Anyway, I go live every Friday at 9 p.m. Come through, join the conversation, and holler at your boy. Heist man, the folk. Talk that talk, ghetto news and opinions. This is a dangerous group, the groups that we're dealing with now. All right. This time, but I'll be back. And sooner than you think. Wherever there's prejudice, ignorance, inequality, I'll be there.